right, I got some hake in this time. Uh, I'm going to show you how to fill it. Hake at the moment uh, is brilliant. It's one of the um, ethical options as far as fishing goes. Good fish stocks and the particular boats that we get them off use uh, large nets with large holes which allow the smaller species and um, juvenile fish to escape. So we're not catching the fish we shouldn't be catching. So it looks after the fish stock. So hake's a great choice at the moment. Lovely fish, not quite as firm flakes as cod, but still large flakes. And if you cook it right, still very tasty. So I'll put a few recipes up as well, but today I'm just gonna show you how to fill it, the hake. Right, so here's our fish. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut in behind the head and behind this fin. Okay, obviously avoiding that on the fillet. So, in from behind the head and down through to the belly. And the same on the other side. Up into the top bit there. Okay. Now I'm going to cut down this line of bones here, down the dorsal fin. And it just starts to open the fillet up and see where the bones are. Okay. Once I've found the bones, the central bone, I just run the knife slightly angled into it start opening that fillet up. And then just remove the fillet by running the knife down the back of the belly there. Now we've got a fillet. All we've got to do now is trim that so I'm gonna, which is exactly the same as the first. I'm gonna come down on the dorsal fins. Okay, so we've got our two fillets off now. So what we've got to do is just remove the belly and the bones, the sort of centre bones, the pin bones. So we can quite simply with cake, because we can't eat the belly at all, it's, it's where all the uh, beasties lie in, we just cut down behind the bones and cut that little belly section out. Okay, and that just goes away. I've got one fillet done with this one. I'm going to just cut in. You can see where I've cut there on the fillet. Cutting the belly away, letting an angle down to where the bones end, the belly ends. Just trim the belly off. That's that simple. Then we end up with a nice clean fillet. Okay. Easy as that. Okay, I'm going to show you now. We've got the fillet here. I'm going to show you how to remove the skin. First of all, we need a nice flexible knife. See this? Flexible knife, that's what I use anyway. Come in at the tail end, hold the tail properly. Cut through just to the skin. 
and then angle the knife flat. Then we just want to cut along with it very slightly angled downwards to remove the skin. And that will allow us to take the skin right off like that. And we've got to fill it with no skin whatsoever on it there. Because basically, most of my guests, and certainly my children, don't like skin on their fish. <laughs> okay, so that's it. Uh, any round fish, as in fish with two fillets, that isn't a flat fish, uh, is pretty much prepared that way. I showed you hate because it's the most delicate and it can uh, totally fall apart completely, so doing it the right way is, is good. But we've got a nice fillets here. And that's it. And what I tend to do is I brine them or salt them down uh, and roll them in cling film and put them in the fridge to set for a while. Uh, and that firms it up and improves the texture. Or, uh, as I'm going to do soon, uh, I'm going to marinate it with a little bit of the miso that I made. Um, and that just gives me a phenomenal finish. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoy it. Always learning. Bite me.